Hey YouTube, so I was going to do this as a kind of like sit down face the camera video but I've decided to do it like this instead because why not um, and you'll probably be able to see things a lot better like this as well um, but this is going to be a what's in my grooming kit video and uh, basically I have three parts of my grooming kit I have all of my brushes and stuff in there and then I have all of my things for feet in there like hoof oil and stuff like that and then this one here is like my summer bag um, and this was originally my grooming kit bag um, but then I got that so I now keep all my summer stuff so I've got like fly spray and stuff like that in there the only thing missing from that is like shampoo and stuff but I don't actually have running water up here so I can't shampoo my horses anyways um, but yeah so I will start with all of my brushes um, basically Donny and Star share this and they share everything basically um, because they are in the same field anyways so it doesn't really matter um, if one of them gets lice because if one does then the other one will as well so that doesn't bother me um, but basically this is Donny's side here and he just has a soft body brush and a hard dandy brush and he also has a little face brush and then he just has a purple hoof pick and um, plastic curry comb um, and basically at the time when I got Donny I decided everything would be purple but I do really need to get new brushes for the both of them um, but yeah so then I have his um, sweat scraper as well but I don't actually use it for sweat I mostly use it when they get wet and I need to uh, wipe off the rain and stuff like that um, and then I just have a pla uh, not plastic uh, rubber curry comb I barely ever use this it's absolutely disgusting um, I only really use the massage inside if I do use it but most of the time I don't um, but I have that and then in Star's side he just has a hard uh, dandy brush and a soft body brush and then he has, um, if I can get it out, a rubber curry comb which is also Nina Clean but I don't tend to use um, rubber ones and then he has a little pink hoof pick Ooh. and then he just has his plastic curry comb and a smaller um, sweat scraper and all of Star's stuff fits in here because his brushes are a lot smaller um, I think this is actually like a kiddie size um, grooming kit that I got for him um, but he is small anyways so it fits him quite nicely um, and then in the other side I basically just have two spare hoof picks um, I have my um, shedding brush or tool whatever you want to call it um, and then I just have a way tape well, weigh tape slash um, height tape, but it doesn't really work that well for height unless you have two people holding it. Um, but I have that. And then in the very bottom, I just have um, two um, main combs that I never use because these don't work. I tend to use like your plastic curry combs for mains. Um, but I have a... Uh, pulling comb and I absolutely love my pulling comb I don't know why but I just like that it has the handle on it um, and then in the very bottom there's just a thinning comb and I usually only use this for stars main um, but it works really really well um, but that's all of the stuff in my sort of um, brushes section um, so then in my feet box I have um, I have a big, if this will stay open, I have a big tub of ethyl and this is what I used to use for Donnie's hoofs um, but my farrier really doesn't like me using it because um, he thinks it just hides cracks and stuff like that um, but I have that and then I just have my sponge that I apply it with and then I have my farrier's favourite stuff um, which is Keratex and it just looks like that and then I just have I don't even know what these are called um, but it just has the little brush inside and that is what I use to put on my Keratex and then I just have a hoof pick because this is my um, feet box so I just shoved a hoof pick in there here I have heaps of hoof picks I know um, 
but I suppose you can't really have too many. Um, but that is what's in my foot box. Um, and then in my summer bag, I have two big sponges in the middle and an old half of a sponge, which is really dirty. And then I just have my phaser. Um, this is really really good for flies but Donnie doesn't like it uh, getting it on because you have to um, put it on with a sponge and he doesn't really like that um, and then at the very bottom I just have this rub on fly repellent um, and this is just really good for faces and stuff like that but I have that and then around the sides I just have my baby oil and normally I wouldn't actually use this in summer unless I had to um, because it's not good for the sun to be like beating on uh, your horse's mane when they've had this on um, and normally it would just be sitting in here but it does sometimes leak so it needs to be sort of like upright so it doesn't leak um, and then I just have my barrier fly repellent and this stuff is really really good again but Donnie doesn't like um, having it sprayed on um, but that's that and then around the side I just have some skin so soft I don't even think this sprays anymore I think the spray is broken so I'm gonna get need to get a new one of those but this is for me um, for the flies in the summer and then lastly I just have some cheap um, sun cream because obviously I don't want to get burned and I can use that for the horses as well if I need to but usually I don't because none of my horses have like um, light skin um, but yeah I think that's all that's in that box but yeah so that's all the stuff in my grooming kit um, I hope you enjoyed this video even though I just done it sort of like this I hope I showed you everything um, well enough but yeah, so I hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one.